for finance people sap has introduced three new tables that will bring uh, as much as possible information from different different modules to that particular single uh, table the first table sap has introduced in s4 hana is ac doka table ac do ca ac doc a some people will say as uh, ac doc a uh, or some will call it as uh, act doc a uh, so this has been called by so many names ac doc table uh, is the one which is been uh, source of truth and it is a key for sap as for hana from a finance point of view so here you will see for company code tata motors us so it will show up all the uh, transactions and if we go to the field level so you can see there are many fields which have been sap has introduced it is more than 300 or uh, two more than 250 fields you can see here all the currency fields quantity po po posting date everything so almost more than 250 now it is reached around uh, more than 300 plus so these are all tables you can see up here uh, fields and if any information is uh, filling in another module or a sub modules that will also come here so all the tables have been merged and created one single table as doka table so this is a Cree table where earlier we we should we were using BSEC table. Now BSEC can be replaced with AC Docker table. Along with that, in AC Docker you will get more additional fields. So other than that, there is one more table has been introduced by SAP is AC Docker P table, and this is for planning. So all the plannings which we do in controlling or any other modules, so that planning. Uh, any other module in the sense like uh, there are possibility that we do a planning from a uh, SAP cloud analytical or uh, some other tools. So that will come to SAP to this particular table, AC DOC T. So these are the fields where you can see the planning has been planned and the amount and every all other information you can see here. Okay, so these are all uh, SAP is tried to bring all the possible fields here. So other than that, uh, there is one more table SAP has introduced is the uh, AC doc Q. So this is a consolidation table. So when you implement group reporting, uh, consolidation reports uh, will fall under this particular table. So when, what is consolidation tables? So consolidation tables are like, uh, it will bring all the information from all other company codes and we try to eliminate the uh, com transactional data, which is specific to uh, inter-company transactions. So uh, here we don't have any transactions, but SAP has uh, given this, uh, AC Docker U table, and you, you can see here these are all the tables uh, fields which will be updated when we use group reporting. So, this is basically used for group reporting. So, SAP has now embedded group reporting as a part of uh, normal S4 HANA only, SPRO. If you go to SPRO and SAP reference IMG. So, this is a module which we have now. Earlier it was not there, so it has been brought up newly in 2018, uh, somewhere around. So this is part of now uh, current R I M G. So all the settings and the configuration will be done here. It is a separate module like MM Finance Control. So you can do a group reporting. In group reporting, it is like a uh, we will eliminate the. Uh, intercompany transaction and we will try to publish the reports. There are many rules have been followed like uh, 
uh, what is my equity uh, based upon the equity method or uh, based upon the uh, percentage method. There are many methods will be used to calculate the uh, consolidation statement and all. Thank you.